As journalists, it is our job to ask questions. Sometimes the answers raise more questions. That's exactly what happened with First Alert investigator Beth Warden, who is speaking with Sam Wright on what happened when a pastor didn't like being asked about his church being a nonprofit. An interview with a visiting speaker is causing a stir on social media and the comments from a controversial end times pastor now has over three and a half million views on TikTok. And that conversation was something that our Beth Warden looked at into and she joins us here at 630. So Beth, give us a little bit of the background on this specific interview. Well, this is uh, Pastor Sharam Hadian and this was his second speaking engagement in Sioux Falls and he's also been speaking at various areas. He is known to be a controversial speaker, and because of that, I wanted to do an interview with him and find out more about the ministry, and I had a few questions about the nonprofit status of their ministry as well. What did you look to inquire about this, this post, and what was it that really spoke to you to dive into this one? Well, um, I was very curious about tax laws and churches, and I thought if I put this portion of the video up on TikTok, maybe I'll get some feedback, what other people are thinking. And so I was getting a lot of responses on TikTok about what are the laws for taxes and churches, and, and uh, should uh, churches have to be a registered nonprofit? Can they just exist because they are? And so it brought up a lot of questions, and it prompted me to look further. Now, did you get some of those answers that you were looking for, or was that anything that was ambiguous? Uh, I was able to get some really good answers. There's a nonprofit consultant right here in Sioux Falls, and I spoke to him about if someone establishes a church, what they need to do as far as the IRS is concerned. And I was really surprised at some of the answers, and it seems like a lot of people watching the TikTok video were surprised as well. And Beth, is there anything else that you've heard from other people in response to this that have got more clarity or anything in that regards? Well, I think a lot of people think that nonprofits and churches are one and the same. So any church needs to uh, do paperwork and become a nonprofit. They can do that if they want to be more transparent with their finances, but they don't have to. And so I think a lot of us are learning along the way, and that's probably why this TikTok video was so viral. And is the full interview, is, is that available for us to see as well? Yep, we've got it up right now, dakotanewsnow.com. And you can just type in the word end time speaker and it'll pop. Beth right Warden looking into this one for us today. Beth, thank you. Mm -hmm.